Hi. Hello guys. Just wait a minute, okay? We have to wait uh, more than 20 people. Okay. So, if you're able to hear me, please uh, press 1, okay? Please comment 1, okay? Please comment one if you're able to hear me. Okay. Hello. Can you hear me guys? Can you hear me? If you're able to hear me, please press one. Okay? Can you hear me? Hi. Hi Nicole. Can you can you hear me guys? Because I just want to double check whether you can hear me or not. Maybe I need to do some setting. Can you hear me? Okay, good, good. Okay, keep comment one. Okay, if you're able to hear me. Okay. So, Ho, can you hear me or not? If you can hear me, okay, please comment one, okay. So we have to wait uh, at least more than 20 people will start the business talk, okay. So, yeah, it's more than 20 people. So just take your time, okay, just waiting here. Okay, because today I today I walk around uh, basically and there are a lot of cafe the cafe they are not doing well so today I'm here to go to going to provide you some solutions okay and we go through these tough situations. No, I, I cannot hear you, you F me. <laughs> okay. So, I still need to wait more other uh, 12 people to come in to see my life. Okay, so after that we will start. More 5 minutes, I think more 5 minutes is better because I don't want to waste uh, your time. Okay. Just wait more five minutes. Yes, Ken is here. Hi, Mr. Kelly. Mr. Kelly, can you hear me or not? Mr. Kelly. COVID-19, yeah, it affects our business, it's, it's totally affect our business and we unable to imagine how serious on this matter, okay. So we have to wait more 11 people and more 5 minutes and we will start our business talk. Wait other five minutes, okay. So at least we need twenty people to to walk to come this live show, okay. 
After three minutes, we will start the talk. Okay. Mr. Kenny, are you able to hear me? Mr. Kenny, if you're able to hear me, please press, please comment one. Okay. Bye, woman, free one. Yeah, please share to your friend, okay, and those cafe owner, okay, who need our assistance, okay, please share and like. Okay, so we have to start our topic today. Okay, we have to start now. Okay, so uh, let me introduce myself. Uh, my name is Luis. I'm from Ikato Group. Okay, we are brain behind F and B businesses. Okay, Ikato. Uh, eventually, we are doing supply like the beverage ingredients, like coffee bean syrup, though real food mix. Okay, but we also support. To our customer, uh, we also more focus on the services like uh, doing developer on developer on the menu park, okay, provide the marketing strategy and the business strategy as well, okay. So today the topic is uh, COVID ninety, okay. What the restaurant and the cafe owner they have to do, they have to prevent this uh, COVID ninety, okay. I believe everybody knows uh, currently Malaysia is locked down and COVID-19 nowadays around the world, okay? And this, the COVID-19 also impact a lot of business, not only uh, the F&B line, like other industry as well, okay? But I, yesterday, I get all the information I saw in the newspaper, I read the newspaper, I get the information for online. Actually, food and beverage industry is damaged the most. Okay, one say so. As I told you, uh, this all from all the information from the news from US, from UK. There are a lot of food and beverage, uh, like cafe, restaurant, they start to close down. And US, some of the food and beverage owner, they ask for help from the government. Okay, this. Uh, quite serious matter okay and just imagine how serious on this matter okay you see a lot of cafe owner the restaurant owner they they planning to shut down okay on this case I'm going to share with you what the cafe owner and the restaurant owner have to do right now okay let, let me let me talk uh, let me talk about their uh, emotional, okay, Defin definitely, as a business owner, okay, they, are, they feel very panicked, they, they feel very fear, okay, I believe they have three types of cafe owner and restaurant owner, okay, so the first one I can say is a fear focus owner, what's the meaning of fear focus owner? Okay, their emotional definitely is very panic. Okay, and they start to think a lot of idea, but honestly, is to tell you, even though you start to think a lot of idea, but because the emotional will affect your idea, so trust me, you're going to do you you're gonna to do a lot of mistake on this matter on this problem. Okay and do the best decision as well 
because the emotion is high, the logic is very low. Okay. And the secondly will be the unfocused owner. The unfocused owner uh, is basically is like, um, for example, just shut down for two weeks. Okay. The business, uh, he say, still can continue after two, uh, after two weeks. Okay, maybe those those business unfocused, uh, unfocused business owner, they will, in in their hell, uh, in in maybe they are watching the video, the Netflix. Okay, just like nothing. Okay, just nothing related to to them. Okay, the third one. Okay, will be the strategy focus owner what they do they're trying to uh, find a way to solve their problem what's the problem carry they'll find a way to solve their problem okay they are not fair they are not panic okay they will just try find a million way to solve the problem to settle down everything okay so i hope that you can understand uh, what's unfocused strategy focus and, uh, and the last thing will be the fear focus, which is panic. Okay, okay. So where you want to be, okay, in this matter, okay, for the fear focus, honestly, I tell you, your business going, uh, you go, your business go do that, okay, and you go into our business because you make a lot of the best decisions, okay, and. Because the emotion is very high, okay. Secondly, for the unfocused owner, the business after two weeks might be okay, uh, just okay, nothing special, okay. But okay, for the third one, for the strategy focus owner, I can tell you, they will go to the next step. They will go. They will go to the next step, because they find a way to solve their problem. Okay, they face the problem and solve it and settle down the problem. Okay, but the conclusions, what I can tell you right now, the only goal you want to achieve, which is you want to keep your business alive. This is uh, conclusion. I believe everybody here, they, it's totally everyone saying right now, because you want to keep your business alive. You want to... Uh, Keep your business alive. This is the most important, and um, which is you have to listen me right now. Okay. During the forty days lockdown, what cafe owner and the restaurant owner able to do? Okay. What you have to do? What you able to do? Okay. Before I start, I want to ask you some questions. Okay. Will you? Keep waiting your customer to walk into your cafe or you want to create an opportunity. If you say, uh, please comment one, okay, if you keep waiting the customer to walk into your cafe, if, if, you, if you agree what I'm saying, comment one, okay. If the second one will be, if you want to create an opportunity, Okay, you want to create an opportunity, please, please comment too. Okay, comment first. Okay, after that, I'm going to tell you what you, what you should do. And I'm going to explain you why. Okay. So, uh, just want to give you some example. If you keep waiting, uh, the customer walk in, definitely your business is going, you're going out of business because you are not create the opportunity, okay? So, if you, uh, if you comment to congratulations because you are in the right life right now, okay? Because I'm going to tell you to how to create the opportunity and at least in this period of time, you, got, you still got the sales, Okay, so since you say you want to create the opportunity, how we create the opportunity? Actually, I have the mindset, which is you create the opportunity, which is minimize your risk, 
and maximize your profit even though this this period of time is a very tough period okay it's very tough times okay so this is the most important okay and just let me know okay and still other question wanna ask you guys okay in this period of time why customer still want to spending money on your cafe okay it's because your coffee is very good or because your food is very good or because your the cafe environment is very good okay you have to let me know okay if you comment because your please comment one okay if you agree i'm saying the com the coffee is very good just comment one okay if you agree what I'm saying is because the food is very good, so please comment too. And the third one, if you if you agree what I'm saying is because the customer walk into your cafe because the environment, please comment three. Okay, because I wanted to know what's the customer walk into your cafe, what they really what they really want, what they really want. Okay, because the coffee, because the food, because the environment, okay. Okay, please comment first. And you have to know, on this period of time, will those customer, which is your loyalty customer, they still will spend money on your cafe and answer why the customer want to spend money, money on your cafe, okay. And you have to know, right now, the all the restaurant or the ca and the cafe they are not allowed to die in. Okay, so definitely that for the environment park, uh, we cannot accept it. Okay, it's because of your food and because of your coffee. Okay, so and I'm going to share with you is uh is the consumer part of you, in the tough periods which is right now. They are, they willing to save money, okay. Better than spend money on your cafe, okay. So what's the strategy? You want to make your customer to spend money on your cafe, and tell me what's the strategy you're going to do, okay? Because I have few strategy want to sharing with you, okay. Before you have to tell me, what's your plan? What's your next plan? Are you going to wait the customer to come to your cafe? Or you're going to create the opportunity, okay? Since uh, the business model is changing too fast, okay, in this type of period, why not you create the temporary temporary menu for those customer, which is customer need or not want, okay? You see, before lockdown, you see uh, still a lot, a lot of cafe and. Walk into your cafe and okay, okay, still can enjoy your coffee, okay. But in this type of period, you get as you can go to the market, you can see all the, the, those cafe they they close down. They are not allowed to die in, okay. So that's why on your on the strategy, what you're going to do is create different menu to your customer which is your customer they really need okay what they need tell just ask your customer what they really need for example i have one of the customer they are doing the steakhouse okay what they are selling is like beef lamb okay on the time of periods um they the the management told me the other management told me I'm say uh he said currently the business is very is very down I'm not going and I'm, I'm, I don't know what should I do then after that I analyze everything I told them why don't you create the different menu for example you can create the pasta like those very cheap carbonara to your customer ask your customer what they really want first. Okay, after that, decide a menu, decide a strategy, and sell the product to your consumer, to your customer.
okay I'm not asking you to reduce the price okay just do it different way just do it different ways because I believe that carrying the manual what I'm just selling right now is not suitable to the market and this is true as you see around the, around the cafe they are not doing anything that's why they are waiting their customer to come to walk in why not you be you become the leader of the this intra industry and do something for your customer and do something for yourself okay beside that the other strategy which is after they create a menu you create the menu you can upsell to your customer okay one say so just imagine today i create a menu which is customer want if i want to earn more money okay I want to earn more money. How? What I'm going to do right now? It's very easy. Okay. For example, you create a drink, or which is the coffee latte. You can upsell the customer. Would you like to add some syrup, our hazelnut syrup, and make you different experience? And this is the way to upsell to your customer. You can extra earn three ringgit. For example, okay. Just just do the calculations. Okay, for example, one people is three ringgit, extra three ringgit, ten, ten people is thirty ringgit. Okay, for a month, it will be nine hundred ringgit. You'll be nine hundred ringgit a month, and which is you can use this nine hundred ringgit a month to cover your render, or maybe you buy other, uh, you can buy other ingredients. Okay, this is your extra nine hundred ringgit. And this is very powerful. Okay. Other than that, maybe you can throw some offer to your customer to attract your customer first. Okay. Maybe you can. The coffee, the coffee uh, currently you're selling twelve ringgit, or maybe you can, you can do it a different way, sell to your customer which is uh, less than twelve ringgit, and upsell your main product. What's your main product? I believe everybody here, their main product, which is is the main cost, which is their food, using the drink as a trip I am, and selling and upsell the main product to your customer. Okay, this is a very simple step. Okay, if you if you need any idea, you can just look for me. You can just PM my team or even don't me, because we are able to assist you on this. Okay. Okay, in the beginning, I, uh, in the beginning, as I say, as you want to waiting your customer to walk in, want to create an opportunity. Just want to let you know, business nothing is free. I'm able to advise you something which is valuable. Okay, it might be the drink, it might be the food. Okay, and using the strategy to sell to your customer, and you must know. What's your main product? Okay, as I uh, what is the valuable? What is the valuable product which is can we the market need? Okay, you have to try to figure out what is the what the customer want. Okay, because you have since you have the idea, for example, the drink. Okay, you it's very easy to upsell to your customer. I'm I'm used to sharing this kind of strategy to my customer and let them know. For example, for a lunch set, okay, come out the package, come the combo, okay, is most uh is which is reasonable one, and sell it to the customer. At the end, upsell a customer maybe at ten ringgit, or maybe nine ringgit or five ringgit. To get something which is valuable to your customer, just trying to do different way and think different different way, okay? Because they have the medium way to to create the strategy and make the make the customer spend on you, and and they have a lot of strategy over here, okay? And as the beginning I told you, uh, um, I have one customer that I'm selling the steak. 
like beef and lamb and actually the last month I think February after the Chinese year I made him okay he told me uh, because the restaurant basically in, in Bukit Bintang area so on the on that timing uh, the business were not not that good okay uh, even though the lunch hour there are not a lot of people to, to walk in so the restaurant owner they start to asking me uh, Luis can you design some marketing strategy for me planning for me because I'm not I'm really don't know what I'm going to do right now and the business is very is very bad and because the call the COVID-19 to impact the business no customer want to die in to enjoy their food okay so after he told me I have the idea which is I say why not you try to do the different way okay for example create a tempor temporary menu okay create a temporary menu which is customer needs and he told me I'm not able to create other menu because due to the manpower problem I'm, I'm not going I'm not going to do that and I provide him the idea which is there with the, the drinks which is healthy because what uh, customer customer uh, customer need right now is healthy okay for example you see the COVID-19 what great food they are selling right now what the food panda are selling right now I cannot say it's not healthy food but I'm, what I'm thinking like it's not the super dope time to selling or the fried chicken and the coke and the Pepsi this kind of thing so that's why I suggest him to do the kuma okay so kuma basically is uh, the we can say in English is called date okay since we are selling the date sauce why not using the date sauce to create something different which is healthy one and create the story right okay to care your customer to care your customer okay using this uh, kuma kuma drink to attract customer first okay the first step is using the story right to attract the customer first and frankly um, the suit the the business currently is okay a bit because they have the storyline okay and we also helping helping him to develop to develop the kuma drinks which is healthy one and at the end I share my my customer once the customer willing to spend on you which is on the kuma drink and it's time to start to upsell to your customer sell your food which is the land and beef okay and this is the strategy i'm going to sharing with you um, this time and our strategy and our strategies can be used for a long time as long as you're doing other business also can use because this one uh, is upsell to your customer okay so currently uh, so after that the customer is doing well okay and I advise him a lot on this command drink we develop <clears throat> some drink which is market they don't they don't have okay so we are also doing the uh, on this on this period of time uh, we Ikiato also doing the promotion as well for the kuma okay can we the kuma sauce we are doing buy one free one okay so if you want if if you interesting you can pm me or you can tell me uh, you can pm me okay if you want to get more information because you are able to download our apps and purchase through the apps and currently we are doing the offer which is buy one free one in our apps okay the benefit of when the COVID 90 okay if we are also able to assist you to develop the 
we also hello uh sorry just now the line is disconnect okay just just want to share with you um after you purchase if you want some idea okay and you you want different idea we're able to assist you we're able to develop the kuma drink uh for you as well for example the soda soda based kuma or ice blended this kind of recipe we're able to assist you on that okay hurry up okay because currently we're doing promotion for this timing only okay and i just want to let you know i just want to let you know guys if you any questions just ask me or just pm me or just look for us uh, our yikato group page our, our facebook page just message us our customer service able to assist you on that okay if you need further assistance, you can just look for us. Uh, yeah, you can just look for us. So I'm going to stop here. I'm going to stop here. If any question, just ask me. And I really hope that my strategy, what I'm providing you right now, is able to help you on your business. Okay. Thank you, everyone. Uh, thank you for your support. Okay. Wish the COVID-19 uh, we tr try to reduce we're going to reduce okay so thank you very much bye